All right, Fuzzed Pie Guy here. You're looking at an eight channel relay that I'm going to be using for this video, hooking it up to a Raspberry Pi that's running the uh, Light Show Pi software. Now, I definitely recommend using the solid uh, state relays versus the mechanical ones, but I had this, so we're just going to use it. So, uh, anyway, we have our pins here. Ground, power, and channel 1 through 8. Then over here, we have ground, VCC, and JD, VCC. And it's got a little jumper on it. Well, we're not going to need that jumper. Because what we are going to do is use an external source to power this. We're not going to use the Pi to power this relay module. So we're not going to use the first or last pin on here. So we're going to hook our ground and our JD VCC to an external 5 volt power source. And I'm just going to use a battery bank for the purpose of this video. Then for the uh, VCC, the center pin, we're going to jump that from the module to the 3.3 volt uh, GPIO pin on the uh, Raspberry Pi. So I have an old uh, Pi laying around here. This is the old school Pi 2. We have our wires here. So let's wire it up. Now, <clears throat> I have this, I've done this little chart up and I have this in color. On my website if you guys want it more than welcome to uh, save the picture so the uh, light show Pi software uses the wiring Pi numbers not the GPIO numbers for the software so in the config file in the light Pi show light show Pi uh, config file you need to put in GPIO 8, let's say you're going to be using that one, or whatever the numbers may be. If you put these numbers in, it's not going to work. And obviously the pin here is the physical pin. Now, the colored picture of this will have yellow and 7 will be uh, red because it can be used for a relay or an antenna for to turn the Pi into a FM transmitter. So what we are going to do is we're just going to start with 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and 7. So in our config on the uh, Light Show Pi uh, config file, we need to put in 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 and not GPIO 18, 23, 24, 25, and so on. Now, if you're going to use the antenna <clears throat> for uh, GPIO 4 for an antenna, then obviously you don't want to use that for your relay. You'll want to move up to, say, uh, wiring pi number 8, physical pin 3. So... Let's get this wired up. Okay, so now if we hold our pie like this, this corresponds just fine. So, what we'll want to do is, if we start with channel 1, which would be my red here, and we're going to go with 0. So, if we go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6... So we need to go six pins down. One, two, three, four, five, six. So I'll go ahead and finish it. All right, so now I got that wired up. And like I said, what we are going to do is we're going to take a jumper and go from the center pin over here on the right. And we're going to go to 3.3 volt pin on the power. Just like that. Now, <clears throat> I just 
have this made up, but we're just going to use this and just got to make sure I use the right one. So my gray is the positive. So we're just going to put the power on and the ground. So now <clears throat> I'm just going to use my battery pack here for the purpose of this video. So we have that powered up. So now let's power up the pie and I'll be right back. All right, so now I'm logged into the uh, pie here. So we're going to go down and CD into the light show directory. Now if we do an ls, as you can see, we got a config here. So we can get into that guy. And we're going to nano into the default. Now, now that we're in here, if we scroll down. Right here is where we're going to make our changes on the... Uh, on the uh, GPIO pins. Now, like I said, remember that uh, Light Show Pi uses the wiring Pi pin number and not the, the physical uh, GPIO number. So, we have it set up right. So, we'll just get out of that guy and we'll see CD back one. And if we just pull up the command here somewhere. Now we can just back out of this one time. All right, so now we're going to run it. So if we run the uh, light show command here. Let me get it up here. And I have another script here that we can just run just to show that each one's working here. All right, well, I'll throw a link in the description to my website uh, for this information and this picture of this in color. So uh, hopefully this kind of helps out. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for another one.